Good morning! On this video we are going to talk about trimming. Not this kind of trimming or rather this kind of trimming. We're gonna be talking about the trimming on the road bike. Trimming versus changing the gear. This is trimming, this is changing the gear, you see? Most of the road bikes will have two derailleurs. Front derailleur, rear derailleur. I do really recommend having front derailleur on a road bike. I wouldn't, I wouldn't really be happy with 1x12 or even maybe 1x13 on the road bike. But anyway, front crankset here has two chain rings. Some crankset on the more budget bikes or I would even say more uh, the bikes for the beginners will even have the triple crankset which is very good for long distance trips in the mountains. The problem is when we are for example using the big ring at the front and we try to use as much as possible uh, gears on the cassette the chain starts rubbing against the front derailleur cage. Same on the smaller gear at the front. If you want to use the smaller cogs at the rear, you're gonna start to hear this metallic sound, which you don't wanna have. Here we go, the big chain ring, the small cog, and we start to ride. This is actually the, the highest speed, so the highest gear as well. But when we slow down or go up the rolling hill, we need to change the gears on the cassette. On this bike, uh, I've adjusted the derailleurs very well, and also the chain line is pretty good. On most of the bikes, you would already hear a lot of rubbing here, but let's go one further. Here we go, you can hear the chain rubbing. I went even one gear up, one gear further here on the cassette. Uh, now as you can see, the chain has to change the direction from the big ring here inwards, the, like the center of the bike. And so, you can hear it rub right here against the internal part of the front derailleur cage and the trimming is nothing more than this. Really small movement of the front derailleur cage and now silence again. And now I'm gonna show you all the options in terms of the trimming. We have the highest gear and the derailleur cage is as far outwards as possible. So this is high speed. Going up the cassette. You can hear rubbing, so we're gonna trim. Okay, the trimming is done. Now we can go, we can go back here, we can go up there and then change the gear. You can hear trimming, you can hear uh, rubbing. Trim again, and then this is the lowest gear. So no rubbing right here, silence, the, high, the, the lowest gear. So we are climbing now. We are climbing now, but then going down the cassette. And this is now close to rubbing, but still not rubbing. But on this gear, you can hear it. So this is a 10 speed cassette, Shimano Tiagra, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight. On the ninth gear, uh, it starts to rub. And that's why I'm trimming outwards now. Done, but not changing the gear as you can see. And then I can change the gear and go here, all right? So if I now move upwards on the cassette and trim here. When I change to, back to the highest gear, there will be some rubbing and then I trim it outwards. You see? So let's go now. Usually if I would change the gears, I would go, let's say, I would go maybe here. And then I would change uh, to the smaller gear here, but also two sprocket down on the cassette. So that's the, the best steps between the, the different ratios. And now I'm going up the cassette, climbing. You can hear some rubbing. 
going down with the front derailleur. Cool. This is cool. And now I would maybe go back like down here, then change the gear, but going back like up the cassette there, perhaps trimming it and then go to the highest speed, trimming it. This is it. Okay, now trimming versus changing the gear. This is trimming, this is changing the gear, you see? So if I wanna trim, I will do just this. If I want to change the gear, I will push it further. Changes the gear. Now, if I'm in the trimming mode, like it's trimmed now so that I can have that really low gear on the cassette, but still large, larger uh, uh, chain ring on the, uh, on the chain set, it's fine. But now when I go back to the highest gear, it's rubbing here on the, on the front chain ring, trimming it back. Why trimming might not work? Uh, two reasons. Reason number one, sometimes uh, the people in the workshop don't know how to do it. The first reason for the trimming not to work and it will usually not work here when the derailleur is in the smaller chain ring, smallest chain ring uh, on the uh, crankset, is that you do the movement. You see, there is, here is my, my palm, I want to show you. I want you to see, to look at this um, shifter here. See, this is very slow movement, but as you can see, okay, now focus on the derailleur, it reacts, right? So I'm trimming. This is tiny movement, this is not changing the gears, it's only trimming the front derailleur. Too low a pressure on the, on the cable means no trimming here. Uh, on the big chain ring, when you trim down, it usually works. This is the problem. So if this one works, everything should work. So more tension on it. So that's the problem you can solve. The other problem, which sometimes you can solve, sometimes you cannot fully solve, is that you have cable routing which is messed up, you have internal cables and you have uh, the, those housing, uh, housings which move while you are changing the gear. So once again, small movement uh, of, the, uh, of the shifter won't actually move the front derailleur because it will only move the uh, housings. You have the tension on the uh, on the cable, but the housings are, we could call it spongy. So uh, making shorter housings, I've showed you that on the episode with this uh, bike, and putting high quality stiffer housings and some oil, some loop on the cable inside the housings, might at least to the larger extent solve the problem. And these are the main issues, otherwise the trimming is no rocket science, right? It should work. So we go, we go up, then I change the gear. Okay. Then on the big gear, I can go down, I can go up, then I change down, change the gear, and then I can trim down. This is it, and then I, then I can trim up. See, it, it all works. but also due to the chain line, which is, in my opinion, quite good here. And we have also 10-speed uh, front derailleur, 10-speed drivetrain, 2x10, which might be easier to set up than the 11-speed. That's it!